Denise1982. What's up? So um, I'm back with another wig review, and um, this is the Sensational Empress line lace front wigs, um, and this is called the Easy Five Loose, and I got it in a number four. So this is what it looks like in the picture. So you can see. Um, it has the option to do a U part with it, and you can see here from the back, you can do um, the natural, which is the U part where you can cut the lace off and then do the, you know, put your hair out, um, or you can do the invisible part, um, or um, you can, of course, just leave it as is. So, and then maybe you put some concealer in here and rock it the way it is. So this is, I'm gonna show you the part what it looks like without um, anything. I didn't put any concealer because so I wanted you guys to see what it looked like straight out of the box because I am gonna style this one. Um, so you can see that it goes all the way back to here. And then this is the hairline here. So you guys can see that. Um, and I am gonna style her so I'm going to cut it in um, shorter layers. Now, if they put this in red, made this in a red wig, I think it would be the perfect, like, Jessica Rabbit wig if you wanted to do something like that for Halloween. Because, I mean, you can see the bangs just fall right in front of your face. So uh, I'm going to do is cut layers into this one. Um, there's already layers in it, but they're really long layers. So you can see here, they're really long layers. You can see from the picture um, that comes in layers and this is um similar to the weave hair that this brand makes um I'm gonna say it wrong but the Kanu Baya Easy 5 wig stuff um you can buy the the extensions for this um and I have purchased some um so I'm gonna make a wig out of them or maybe install them but this is similar to just put it into a wig um I believe I paid $30 for this wig and and um Sam's Best Beauty, or Sam Beauty, SamBeauty.com. Um, yeah, sorry, let me go check my receipt. So I did get it at Sam's Beauty, and it was $27.99, and I got it at a four. And again, this is a Sensational Synthetic Lace Front Wig, the Empress Line, um, Easy 5L Part Loose Waves. So they have like three or four different ones. Um, one's a tighter wave, one's the looser wave, which is this one. One's like a real curly hair. Um, and this just recently came out. I haven't seen them very much in the on the other websites. So I'm gonna go ahead and style this one and then I will be back. Okay, I'm back. So I styled it. Um, so you, if you noticed before, the bangs went all the way down um, a little bit. So. What I did was I cut the bangs a little bit shorter and I went down. So if you remember before, the layers were started like down here. Now they're starting up here. And I cut off some length um, before it was going probably to my butt. <laughs> it's really, really long. And so I cut off probably about three or four inches. Um, so basically, here I'll show you. This is about as much hair as I cut out. Um, and let me find, I think this is about how much I cut off the bottom here. So, um, now before it was going probably to my stomach, now it's just right above my, my, uh, chest. So the way the cap is constructed is a stretch cap. It does have the two, um, bra strap stuff in the back. There's three combs, two right here to secure it in the front and then one in the back. Um, so if you choose to wear it as a U part, you have the comb options, um, and of course the options to add more combs in the end. The cap does stretch, but it's a little snug. You want to make sure that you have your hair braided, um, correctly and flat when you're wearing this one because it's just constructed, you know, for people that have bigger heads and maybe tend not to braid their hair up in the back, um, for protective styling when you're wearing wigs and, um, just keep that in mind. I just French braided my hair and then, you know... Cut the put the length up in the back so um it's a really pretty way i got it in number four the layers are really pretty um now and originally it's just it was just too flat it was too 70s flat for me originally so and i like to have stuff frame my face and i like it you know bigger in the front so um again, this is what it looked like 
before. So see how long it is on her and she's probably way taller than me. Um, it's past her boobs. It's down here. So it's probably about a good 24, 26 inches long. Um, now I got it probably to an 18 inch. So I'll give you an idea of how much I cut it. And then um, the hairline again. This is what it looks like. Let's have an idea. Um, the hair is a little shiny, so you might want to use some baby powder on it. Um, but I think this is the kind of hair that once, you know, you wear it for a while, um, a good month or so, it'll start to look more realistic. Um, but you might, if you were trying to rock it, um, immediately, then yeah, you might want to take some baby powder that. I'm back shine. now. Um, so I have it as close as I can to where I usually part my hair, but you have the option, the way the lace is made, you have the option to make it a more of a deeper part than what I put it as, um, because you have the L-shaped part on it. But again, you have some versatility with this wig basically is what I'm getting at. You have the options to do different part styles. Um, obviously it's gonna be on this side, um, which is my right side. Um, so I normally wear my part on my left side, but whatever, it is what it is. Um, but you can, you know, do this with it the way the lace is made on the wig. So um, it gives you an option. So anyways, this is my two cents. Um, I will do an update on this hair. I'm going to wear it for a few days. Um, and I will let you guys know. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.